Okay, moving along, telangin. Telangin, yeah. So telangin, again, another uh, ingredient that also has a partner ingredient. So telangin and another called delescence were introduced at the same time. And these are both um, designed to help to reduce, well, let's, let, let me take a step back. They're really marketed for helping to treat uh, skin of inflammatory nature. They, they started to introduce them to help to address clients with rosacea, rosacea patient skin. Um, but really their main function is to downregulate inflammatory mediators. So uh, there's um, molecules called cytokines, which are cell communication messengers. They're basically peptides that are produced by certain cells that can influence the behavior of other cells. Some are very good uh, and some are very bad. So when you look at the inflammatory cascade or what creates inflammation, a lot of these cytokines are responsible for this. And there's um, two called, one's called interleukin-6 and the other is called interleukin-8. And both of these peptides are designed to, in two very different ways, reduce the amount of interleukin-6 and interleukin-8 that are released through other mechanisms. And again, just like pigmentation, inflammation follows a very specific pathway. So if, if you're taking any kind of anti-inflammatory drugs or even ibuprofen, they're disrupting a part of the inflammatory pathway, but we can also do this topically. And it's not exclusive to rosacea, things like, again, psoriasis, any kind of contact dermatitis. A lot of these ingredients are used specifically to inhibit these different portions of the inflammatory pathway. And we can get a really good result with this. We use these uh, typically in our um, sensitive skin products, so things like the Chronocalm, uh, the Tranquility Cream, you see those a lot, uh, but also in, again, the Marshmallow Whip Hydrating Mask, things that we want to help to reduce inflammation, as well as the um, Snow Algae and Spirulina Cooling Mask. So things that are gonna help to reduce visible signs of inflammation, these work very, very well.